Hi, welcome to Garden Friends. I'm here with one of my favorite non-moving garden friend, my pink ball tree. If you remember from some of my videos in December, this is my pink ball tree, Dubaya Walichi. He's from Madagascar. And at Christmas time, it blesses us with these beautiful big pink balls of flowers. It's, it's like an outdoor Christmas tree. But, you know, plants are not immortal. And now he's got quite a few brown bulbs on him. Now, I don't, I don't deadhead it because I would hate it if I had to deadhead all of these individual balls. I'd be here forever. I would need like a bucket truck and we, we just wouldn't be doing that. But what I am going to do is I'm gonna cut some of the branches. It's not time to really trim him back and give him a good trimming, but when I do, this will take me about two weeks because of just the, the amount that I have to trim and then how I have to cut it up to put it into my buckets for the city to take away. So I'd like to get started now and do some of the branches that have got mostly spent blooms on them. And the leaves, you can see, I mean, leaves are not immortal either. And it has survived some cold snaps and some wicked weather. I'm really happy with the way it came through our storms that we had this year and the freeze, which we don't normally get. So I'm going to start here. I'm just going to come back to that one there. So the more that I can trim now, the easier it will be when I give it its big haircut in the spring. So I'm going to do that. This one, very nice bulbs. If we were way down here, where we could see them. But we're going to take him there. Doing this will also help me see some of the blooms that still have yet to open, um, especially deep inside. There's a lot of smaller blooms and they're going to be opening. And if I leave all of these on my tree, I'm not going to be able to see this from the kitchen window, which is kind of the whole point. So I am going to take a few more, just pull it down. Um, let's try like so. And I've got quite a few that I'm going to do. I'll probably fill up a couple buckets full before I call it a day. So that is my update on my pink ball tree. If you still like my tree, like my videos, and I will catch up with you soon.